When garbage collectors take our trash away, we usually don't think about it again. But a German artist, H. A. Schult, is transforming trash into something very familiar. And he's giving us the chance to think about trash in a new way. I made thousand sculptures from garbage. And these sculptures are people like us. H.A. sculpted the trash people out of materials from a German landfill. But you can find these materials anywhere in the world. The garbage today is an international garbage. We know that the garbage of China comes to Europe, the garbage of Europe goes to Russian, uh, the Russian garbage goes to South Africa. We are in a, in a, in a time where the world may be garbage. We are on the garbage planet. H.A. shows his art around the world. He wants people to see that garbage is a problem everywhere. Everywhere in Gizeh, in Egypt, or in China, on the Great Wall, people had, have known that I show the problem of our time. And these problems are in every country the same. H.A. first set up 1,000 trash people in Zanten, Germany. Then they went to Red Square in Moscow. Along the Great Wall of China. To the foot of the Matterhorn in Switzerland. And then to the Egyptian pyramids. Now the trash people are at National Geographic headquarters in Washington, D.C. H.A. A. watches as workers set the trash people up. But he lets the sculptures tell their own story to the visitors. I think the answer to the future will come of the children of today. And the children are traveling also around the world now because we are living in a global village. What does our garbage say about us? The trash people don't talk, but they clearly have a lot to say. <laughs>